Welcome everybody to the first video of the 2024 Round Britain Rally. Runs from uh, March, April, depending where Easter is, to the end of October every year. And the idea is we go out and find different landmarks, artefacts and gain points in doing so by proving that you've been there by taking a picture of your bike with your ID card on your bike and also you can use uh, historic vehicles as well as trikes. Last did it in 2022, gave it to miss last year, we were doing the uh, road rallies more, but the rules state you can't uh, publish any of the information regarding the clues or indeed the answers until after the end of the rally. So that's why you're seeing this now. It's currently April, middle of April here in England, and we've got 40 mile an hour winds roughly. And we haven't had that much rain in the last hour, but we've had hail. And that hail hurts on your thighs at 30 mile an hour when they're at least 6 millimetre across, which is a quarter of an inch in uh, English. But when it does stop, it's beautiful. We've already done about 12 miles, we're in Staffordshire. That's your first clue. Now, what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you perhaps a poor, maybe even lousy, cryptic clue or maybe it's something I can put a, more of a question to so to give you an idea, like I did in 2022 give you an idea, a, a chance if you like to try and work out what I'm going to see now some of these things, these landmarks are quite obscure so this one I haven't been able to find much about and I forget how many points it's worth but we'll sort that out at the end <laughs> all being well it should be easy to get to and easy to find <laughs> he says this is a uh, first um, real uh, out here on a bike that's not just for transportation this year really extremely slow start although Hopefully by the time you see this video, I'd have been out and about doing other things, but I'm doing uh, <laughs> You probably noticed by the lack of videos. I'm not doing any or haven't done any Road rallies this year It's possible. It's just gonna be this round Britain rally. We ain't gonna go too far. I reckon about another I don't know eight ten mile tops going into the National Forest We're uh, not far from the A38 and uh, you can hear me through the wind, I've closed the voice a bit um, we're not far from the A38 and uh, bikers will and canal folk will know the Mucky Duck at Fradley Junction that's not far away either now I've closed my voice, it's steamed up across here I think, so I'm going to have to open it again <laughs> over the Trent into a little pleasant little place called Yoxall. So a clue then, a clue, let's give you some time to work it out. Uh, by all means put your ideas down. This is fairly obscure, I've probably been past it lots of times but never noticed it. So your cryptic naff clue is, oh, what can I call it? Um, Water point head. Yeah, that'll do. Water point head. And it's in Staffordshire. And I'll give you uh, the, uh, well, I suppose it's a bit of a village, really. The name of the village when we get there. Right, this is Yoxall. We'll turn right shortly. Or maybe I've missed the turning. I probably have. But we'll show you Yoxall. Nice little place, couple of pumps. Some nice old buildings. But uh, we'll go up to the mini roundabout and come back. Not very warm today. I'm reckoning currently, without the wind chill, it's about six degrees. Although it feels better than that. 
in the sun better view of the church very pleasant suppose things wouldn't be the same if I actually went there the right way straight off but you know we'll keep the tradition of uh, making a mess of it <laughs> okay I have looked at a map but that's a few hours ago now now in theory up towards Barton turn left I think at Barton Barton underneath wood just a short little run to Barton underneath wood and we'll have a look at the road signs no not yet although it might be possible that way too idle to stop and check the map yet pleasant place Barton two or three pubs still open road works as there is everywhere but uh, none of them fixing potholes of which well some of our potholes have roads if you know what I mean right is it left here? I do see a sign across the road and it says it says what we want so it is left there we'll just turn here nice signpost there and the name of the village we want is on that sign Tate Mill so there's your shall we say second clue helping we are looking for Waterpoint Top in Staffordshire specifically Tate Mill in Staffordshire I suppose we could have come across the lanes from Yoxall, but one mile away. Okay, this should be Tate Mill. I should uh, say that I'm trying to beat my previous score from 2022, which was just below. We're looking for Main Street. Ah, we've got to pass these rocks here. This should be Main Street. Yeah, it is indeed. Um. I started at the bottom in 2022, leaving something to shoot for over several years. And I managed to go one up on that quite easily, but fell short of the bronze uh, award by about 15 points didn't get a chance to just get out and do another one so this time our aim is to beat or rather get to 399 points which will beat our score from last time and give us a bronze award and then we'll leave others for future years so Main Street we've passed the pub uh, my uh, we say logistics helper this morning 
said it was a few hundred yards past the pub so uh, we should be coming up on it shortly any ideas folks water point top it's behind a fence at least it wasn't a picture I found on the web indeed it still is and here we are it's a wellhead restored it's a bit narrow so we'll push the bike out the way now we have to mount our uh, ID card so it seems to be windowing after this and you must show your reg number on at least one photograph that you enter for each bike, trike, historic vehicle you use. Here comes the rain, let's get on with the photograph. So here's our first RBR landmark for the 2024 season. This restored, at least it was restored some years ago. I'm thinking it was about best part of about 15 to 20 years ago. This wellhead and I tried to find some information about the history, if there was anything. But the only thing I could find was that it was possibly used as a holy well but nothing definite 